Hello everybody and welcome back into the studio. Today I am going to be doing the non-metallic metals on the blades and the feet or at least prepping them with the airbrush. If I sound a bit muffled it's because I've actually got um, a mask on today uh, to save me doing a separate voiceover I thought I'd just do it as I paint and I'm going to paint using a mask until I get sick and tired of it which is almost soon in fact pretty much now um, I'll put a mask on when I start painting um, so what I'm going to do is work up the non-metallics using um, a series of colours from Vallejo Dark Sea Blue through scale colour Caspian Blue Anthracite Grey Graphite and then Nacar um, which with the exception of the Dark Sea Blue come from uh, scale 75's non-metallic silver set uh, which is a pretty good set um, so I'm going to do the knife blade the axe head just the blade of the sword the other bit the pommel and stuff I'll do by hand um, and then the feet I think it'd be quite nice to give him some armoured boots before we dust them all up and everything um, so uh, the dark sea blue is in the airbrush already and the compressor is not on, which is odd. Uh, hang on. Oh, it's because I put the wrong. Have I? No. The compressor is not on because I didn't plug it in. Yeah, that was stupid, wasn't it? There we go. The happy sound of a purring compressor. Okay, so I'm going to mask up and um, let you follow me spraying the blues and stuff on. Okay, so let's go. I'm gonna run some uh, some air through and pull some colour through and see how I'm doing. Predictably, it's probably fine. Yeah, it is. Okay, so uh, now we're gonna just base coat all of the metals first. We're not gonna be particularly. Uh, impressive with this, we're just going to get on with it. The sword on this model is so flimsy, it's kind of broken three times already, so the airbrush is actually quite a nice light touch way of doing it. I think you'll all agree the new camera setup is working better um, insofar as I can uh, actually paint on camera now. Okay, so now I'm gonna <coughs> just, just don't clean the airbrush as normal. Give it a bit of a dry off. And then the majority of this blade is actually going to be quite dark because of the source lighting. So what I want to do is add some blue hints into it. 
and I'm going to use for that a scale 75 Caspian blue which is quite a nice desaturated grey blue it's a very nice desaturated grey blue um, and it should help me to start to put some of the contrast in See, it's quite, a, quite an interesting colour. Okay, and for this, what I'm going to do to start off with is the the blade of the knife, because uh, if I try and do the boots first, when I do the blade of the knife, I'll ruin the boots. Let's just dry the blade of the knife first. I'm going to do the boots. Okay, now I'm going to go onto the blade. So what I'm doing there is just building up the blue steel.
So now I'm going to add a little anthracite grey into the blue. Just a little. That will bring the colour of our blue down a little bit. a bit more than that. <clears throat> Probably not that much. <laughs> That's that colour done. Now we're going to start to add scale 75 graphite.
just being careful to pick out <coughs> just to certain areas that I want. So what you can see <coughs> I've done there is just start to build up the lighter tones but they're following a path and the light is joining up So that's 20 minutes, I'm going to stop here, uh, have a breath of fresh air, and then I'll come back with the next one. Cheers guys.